I'm sitting here on the porch of the championship mansion down here in Westminster, South Carolina. I'm wearing my World Series winning San Francisco Giants jersey. And in the distance, I don't know if you can hear it, but just down the road at the racetrack, you can hear the race cars going round and round and round, and I hear them in the distance, just like, just like I hear all the teams in the Flair for the Gold Fantasy Football League. I hear them all in the distance. I hear them all in the background. Because none of you, none of you came close to unseating me last year. And none of you will even get a whiff of that championship this year. Now I want to address a few issues. I want to address some things. First of all, personally, I've seen a unicorn. I've seen the Loch Ness Monster. I've seen Bigfoot, but I've never seen Mo Man cut a promo. See, he'll uh, get in on somebody else's video. He'll make a, a little appearance here and there. But as far as speaking for himself, I'm starting to wonder if Mo Man's a real person. I'm starting to wonder if it's just Jam Patterson under the mask or Michael Jernigan under the mask. I just don't. No. And he came out and he said, hey, if Stud Stable wins a league, he'll quit the league. Well, let me tell you, Mo Man, you would better enjoy this season. Because you're done. Because I will repeat, I will go back to back. I want to address something else. I want to address all the shady dealings in this league. They're trying to run off my man, Chase Smith. TBD. Nobody knows the name of his team. I'm going to tell you, Chase, you better win the title this year and run with it because these boys have already conspired to vote you out. I was going to wait a few days to make this video, but I saw the Icons video, and it's just such a sad thing. You see, on Thursday nights sometimes I'll turn on Impact Wrestling, and I'll see the original Icon, Sting, and I see that he is just, such a shell of his former self. And he seems that he's not playing with a full deck and he just, he just doesn't have it anymore. And sometimes when I see the icon Jam Patterson, I wonder if we're seeing the same thing. I'm wondering if the icon's prime is past. I see newcomers in the league. I see youngsters. I see Dakota Murph Patterson, who just graduated, going to turn 18, going to be able to vote, going to be able to kiss a girl, going to go to college, going to make a big name for himself. Son, it's over. You're not going to make a name for yourself in my league, so you better get the rest of your friends that are living in their parents' basement who can't put down their Halo 8 controllers, and you better get a side league with them so you'll have a chance. Because Flair for the Gold is for men. It's for the big boys. And we'll see if you've got the guts to cut a promo and come on here and prove your mettle. Travis Shannon, I want to say welcome from the Mountain West League. You'll have to excuse my friend Jan Patterson. He wouldn't know Gillette, Wyoming from Gillette Stadium in Foxborough, Massachusetts. So, Travis, it's great to have you. You're a great addition. And, and on that note, I want to say to our commissioner, thank you. Job well done. You have brought in two outstanding teams to expand our league. I want to also thank you for the way you conducted the draft lottery and that it was on the up and up. And I also want to thank you that you're so clueless when you draft that I won't even have to worry about Bobby the Brain this year. So I want to say thanks.
boys, I, I'm here to stay. I'm here to stay. I, I hear you. I hear you off in the distance. I hear the announcer saying what place everybody's in. Boys, you're just like those race cars. You're off in the distance, and you're going around in circles, and I'm looking at you in my rearview mirror. Whether you like it or you don't like it, learn to love it because it's the best thing going today. Woo!